All right, Flubaroo Part 2, actually pulling out specific grades. So I'm going to add a column right here next to score. Insert one left. I'm going to change this to standard 1. And this to standard 2. Obviously, you would put in your actual learning standards. I'm going to delete the not graded part. Now, if I want to pull the scores for standard 1, here's what I'm going to do. I go ahead and click this function button, sum, and then it's going to want to know what I want to use. Questions 1, 4, 7, 9, and 11 are all standard 1, let's say. And it will autofill. And so since I did um, 1, 7, 9, 11 over there, I'm going to do the rest for standard 2. So again, you hit the sum button, click on the ones that you need. You get the idea. Um, I'm not going to fill them all in and bore you, but you get the idea. So then you can use this to actually tell you how they did by standards. For that, we're going to use conditional formatting. So there's one more video for today. Where I'm just going to show what a conditional formatting would look like. You'll see that this second standard is cleaned up and I actually have the scores on it. See you in a minute.